Let's take a look how to make this glued text here in Blender. First press Shift plus A and we're gonna go and select the text, hit the tab button and rename it, press tab again and let's go to the data here, open up the font and here we can change up the font. And I'm gonna select the bubble and here what we're going to do is right click on it, convert to mesh, hit tab, hit A to select everything, press X and select dissolve faces to clean this up and right click on it. Let's go to separate and select by loose parts. So now we're going to need to extrude it manually separately one by one. So for example, I'm going to select the letter R. As you can see, this is selected. Press the letter A to select everything. And I'm going to go click on the minus Y, for example. Press the letter E here and bring this up. So it's going to extrude it. Now hit the tab. And I'm going to deselect everything and click somewhere here. So it's going to select the other letter. And I'm going to go back to minus Y, hit tab. Press A to select everything, press E and extrude. And we're going to repeat the same step, hit tab, select. Now make sure it's on yellow, not on orange. And then hit tab again, press A, press E and so on and so forth. And then the next thing we're going to do is right click on it and select origin to geometry. So this way it's going to reset the X, Y, Z axis. Repeat the same step with the rest. And now we're going to rotate and stick the letters together. So I'm going to start with the letter P and I'm going to rotate something like this. Select the letter A, bring it in and then rotate in different direction until you're going to find a sweet spot. And make sure to stick them together, something like this. So for example, if I press the Z axis, it is going to look something like this from the top. And I'm going to repeat the same step on the rest. And from here, we're going to need to activate an add-on. So let's go to Edit, Preference. Let's go to Add-ons and search for Bool. Make sure to activate the Bool tool. And after that, select all the letters. And let's go to Object. Let's go down all the way where the Boolean is and select the Union right here at the top. So it's going to unite all the letters. Right-click on it, set origin, origin to geometry. And then from here, we're going to go to the modifiers, add modifier, search for remesh, enter and go to smooth, uncheck, remove disconnected, increase the arc tree depth to nine. And let's go to the arrow and select apply. Now let's go and add another modifier, type in smooth corrective and enter. And here first, we're going to, need to check the only smooth. And then you can increase the repeat and take a look at that. It is going to melt together the shapes. You also can increase the factor and pretty much that's how you make it. And let's go and hit apply, right click on it, select shade smooth and pretty much there you have it. Now, of course, the topology is a total mess, but, <laughs> but this is pretty good for these liquid experimental stuff. And pretty much this is it for today. Next time I'm going to try to learn it, how to do it more professionally and see you on the next one.